Sarasota Tim. Yeah, he might talk like a conservative, but he lives his life like a liberal. And <laughs> Tim said the funniest thing I ever heard in my life. That's right. To me, he talks like a conservative, but we all know he lives like a liberal. But before we do that, let's talk about Living Free Mike. So Mike is still moving crap from the old property to the new property. He's talking about it should be up for sale in November. But anyway, it's just, I don't know. You, you watch him walk around here and gather up all the crap and point to all the shit that he says he has to still gather up. I mean, the land, yeah, it was just, I guess when you live in an RV, you like all the land so you can just collect a whole bunch of crap and just scatter it all over the place. I mean, Mike's property and Tater's property, they both look the same. They both look like literal dumps. I mean, there's shit strewn about. There's a pile over here of this and stuff. I don't know. You'd think if, you know, they had some land and spent all that money, especially like Tater with Tater land, putting all his little shacks up and like his big daddy, Kevin and, you know, paying to put stone in his little roads and this and that. You'd think it, you want it to look decent instead of having garbage and shit strewn about all over the place. And Mike's land is just, man, it's crazy. And then, of course, it's, you know, it's Mike, so it's, yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, I know I should do it this way, but yeah, whatever. So, yeah, he has a whole bunch of DIY half-ass projects laying around. I, I don't know. Even his... <laughs> Uh, even his raised beds for his gardens and everything, it's just haphazardly thrown together. So I don't know. Maybe when he walks around the old property and, and looks at everything, maybe he'll go, yeah, maybe I should maybe I should do a little bit better on the new property because this looks like shit. All right, let's talk about Timmy! Yeah, um, well, first, <laughs> oh, carnivore diet. Yep, just one more thing that uh, Timmy runs around and running at the mouth about and he doesn't have any idea what the hell he is talking about he does it, it's uh, atkins this i don't know where this carnivore word came from and yeah i'm doing this and he doesn't have a clue he is clueless and then he said something i can't remember exactly what but i did watch a little bit i was skimming through but i caught a bit where he said well yeah i was talking to uh, one of my friends and they're in the medical field and uh his wife is too, and they said da. So let me get this straight. The guy who said you don't need health insurance because you're healthy as a horse, and the third leading cause of death in the United States is doctors, and you don't need doctors and you don't trust doctors. Now all of a sudden you got friends that are doctors that are telling you all this stuff, and now their word is gospel. I you just can't keep up with the guy. What is it, Tim? You hate doctors. They're dumb. They're going to kill you. Uh, you don't need health insurance, but you should go talk to your friends that are doctors and listen to what... I don't know, man. You're confusing as all hell. But what I really want to talk about is Tim's political views. I, I see he's on the, the new thing now. I guess he's going to be current events, Tim, and he's going to start pushing about the election since it's just right around the corner. So Tim's going to make videos about voting for Trump, 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 Trump. So I just had to skim through. I had to, I just had, he sucked me in. I haven't watched him in so long, but I had to admit, he got me with this one. He got me. So I was listening to what Tim says, but it's funny because just think about good old Timmy. He talks all this. Oh, well, yeah, the conservatives and this and that and Trump, Trump, Trump and this and that and that. And, but he's the guy that should be the biggest Democrat, the biggest liberal ever because he lives a liberal lifestyle. I don't want to work. I just want to sit back and get all the free money. I want PPP loans. I'm going to collect that extra unemployment. I'm going to apply for EIDL even though I really don't have a business. I'm going to retire as soon as possible and get that free check. That's right. Free check. Tim is all about sitting back and, you know, spreading the wealth and collecting money for doing absolutely nothing, doing the least amount. 
I mean, breathing is too hard for Timmy some days, but he wants paid for it, but he don't want to do anything, and he wants the government to do it all. So I don't understand this conservative yabber when he lives like a liberal. Now, Timmy, he says that, you know, he doesn't watch the news, and he proclaimed that. Now, I'm not, I'm still not watching, and, and no, you know, people just listen to this and that and that, and they just say the same old stuff and repeat the same agenda. But no, not me. I'm a guy with common sense, so I come up with my own ideas. And no, 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 I'm still not watching the news. I'm watching the man himself, he says. But no, come, come on, man. And then we watched a um, couple of things on TV, uh, political. <laughs> you know, they like watching that. So, Timmy didn't watch the news yeah he did tim sits down with the old couple he watches some tv some political stuff that they want to watch and then they sit back and talk about it and then what does he do he gets on and makes a video and just regurgitates what he heard that's what he did it's not what he thinks or anything else because again tim lives the liberal life i want to live i want to Say I'm a minimalist, but I want to collect as much shit as I want. I want you people to buy me a coffee so I can go out and buy shirts and this and that and make car payments and this and do that and go to the car wash every day. I want that free check. I don't want to pay for health insurance. You don't need health insurance, but now I get it for free. Bring it. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give me more free shit. My free health insurance, it's not enough. I want them to give me money back. I want them to do this. I want a free check. Give me, give me, give me. Let me sit on my ass and give me. That's not the conservative way, Tim. Conservatives go to work. The only thing conservative about you is your fake religion stuff because the conservatives is all about God and country and this and that and that. But no, Tim, you need to stop, bro. You, you, you are a prime example of talking the talk, but not walking the walk because conservatives and you're going to build America and do this and do that. Then you need to get off your lazy flat headed ass and go work. But no, you want money for nothing. That's right. That is the liberal way. And that is what you are, Tim. And you need to come to grips with it. My boy. Then I'm literally, literally, Laughed out loud. That's right. I was watching and uh, skimming through, hit another little point, listened for a while, and Tim was talking about, well, yeah, I probably won't talk about this much longer, and blah, 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 blah. But yeah. <laughs> Tim, I'm going to use good old Timmy. I'm going to use one of his sayings. Tim said the funniest thing I ever heard in my life. My channel will, after it's over, um, you know, I don't even know how many more of these I'll talk about. I've said all I need to say. I don't know. I don't have to keep beating a dead horse. They can watch this video over and over and over if they want, <laughs> or whoever discovers it. <laughs> I don't have to keep beating a dead horse. They can watch this video over and over and over again. But I'm going to make at least once a week retire to 62 collect your social security i'm gonna make that video over and over and over and over again but now i'm not gonna talk about this no sense of beating a dead horse i said it already right you can come watch this again oh but guess what i'm gonna do tomorrow i'm gonna make eggs drink coffee go to walmart what am i gonna do the day after make eggs drink coffee and go to walmart but i'm not gonna do this again and beat a dead horse you can watch this video over and over and over again he said the funniest shit I ever heard in my entire life. Can you believe he had enough nerve to look in the camera and say that shit and then post it? <laughs> no sense in beating a dead horse. They can watch this video over and over again. But they can't watch that retired at 62 video over again. <laughs> they'll never find it i have to make one at least once a week and no one ever saw me go to walmart i got to do it every single day whoa man wash rinse and repeat tim oh my goodness this is why i can't watch the dude <laughs> 
I haven't watched him for so long. I watched two little videos because it had all about his little political shit. I wanted to hear what he was saying. And this is what happens. This guy is a giant fool. But hey, you don't have to agree with me. That's never the point here. The point is... This is Blind Views, and that's the way I see it. What we do here is go back, 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 back.